Hi, I'm Mike, founder of Total Boat. And today we're here, uh, made our super seascape diorama uh, miniature model uh, boating thing. Winter Wonderland. Winter Wonderland. We just made a diorama out of Total Boat products to rival all dioramas ever made out of Total Boat products. That's one hell of a shoebox. I thought I remember one of shoebox. Is that uh, just any size? No, no, we just, we made a little... Uh, Amazing winter wonderland. We're going to make a big landmass. We're going to have a little island in the center. We're going to do epoxy waves. We'll have a few buildings. There'll be lots of lights, some boats, and we're going to just see what happens because we're kind of all wigging it. This is a miniature version of Maker's Workshop. I made it on solid mulberry that we milled and dried ourselves. Solid mulberry laser ready sheets. Today we're building a scenery on a ocean or a lake or something like that. We have a few of our shops in there. And other than that, we'll see what happens. Today I ended up working on painting the stained glass for Jimmy's barn. And then I also worked on the All Makers Welcome sign. Well, I built my shop, I brought that with me. So I brought the barn. I built Jimmy's shop, brought that with me. His shop is slightly smaller than my shop, you might notice. What else did I do? Oh, I built a Coast Guard boat. A little laser cut Coast Guard boat. I did a bunch of foam pouring too. That was probably a bigger aspect of the whole thing was the big foam mountain in the corner for Jimmy's barn. I made a scale model of our shop maker's workshop and then I also worked on a living hinge laser cut boat. And I did a 3D printed lighthouse. The original plan for the total boat holiday makeup was to get a number of our, our local influencers to come into the shop and basically get creative and hang out, and make some stuff, and have a lot of fun. We had everything to about 136 scale. The big plan was to turn the train set into a boat parade, because uh, boats are cooler than trains. From there, everybody sort of started filling in with different ideas that sort of came together as they were here, or they collaborated on things. It was better than we could have imagined, I think, because everybody had different skills and, and little sort of tricks up their sleeve that they showed up with. We painted the whole landmass, and then after that we covered it with a paste so we could attach the, the fake foliage, the grass, and everything like that. And then after we did a massive epoxy pour, the ocean waves all around it, and then we were able to add the other little parts to the boats and stuff like that. That one's so oh cute! My God. I love this one! Yes, um, I've definitely worked on some ocean scenes before, so I was really excited that I was invited to be part of this project. That's what you call teamwork, okay? Lessons will be learned today. It was all good except for the, you know, once Derek put his little door in the side of the mountain and ruined the whole thing. Let's see, what, what do we contribute? I made the Total Boat logo boat, so the you boat did? that was inspired by the Total Boat logo. I made that. I made a little sailboat. Check out a little sailboat for a friend. Especially that woman swimming in that. That's it, face down. Unbelievable. Yeah, she looks really dead. <laughs> the original plan was to build a diorama. Katie and Kristen came up with that, and after that, it was pretty fluid. But it was incredibly collaborative and uh, very last second. It came out great. It's really cool to see everyone collaborate on something like this that has so many different elements. Usually when you're working on a project, you're just thinking about it on your own. And so it's nice to be around other creative people who will give feedback or help you think of ideas you otherwise wouldn't have thought of. I criticize you all the time, what are you talking about? Yeah, but like, it's you. It was really cool in the end to see how it all came together. Uh, I think nobody knew exactly how it would all come together, but with all this talent here, we just sort of trusted that people would bring different ideas, bring different processes, and specialties to it, and at the end, that's exactly what happened. Um, it was a blast being able to work with all of our friends today. Um, it was awesome to have everybody together and have one vision and then actually make it come to life. It was beautiful. Yeah, it was, a, it was, was a lot of fun. It was fun to kind of learn how the people that pour the epoxy, the lotion uh, yeah, waves was... and stuff, it was cool to see how they did that. I always wondered how they got that foamy look. It's good to see them work on it up close, ask them some secrets, yeah. trade secrets. Yeah. It's good.
I think from the very beginning, the vision was to have a shop and a place where we could have our friends come in and, and work with them and build stuff. And some of it was about making content. A lot of it was about learning and learning new techniques and sort of utilizing all of our friends who were using the products. And then it was also about sharing uh, product knowledge and, and training people. And it's been really fun to have this make off and we're really looking forward to doing a, a bunch more in the future.